Gary, you're black? That's 5%. It got some alcohol in there, so I'm drinking it. I don't drink anymore. I don't drink any less. Slightly cloudy. A little bit of carbonation in there. From my good friends at M&M Beer. All right, everybody, we're back with another beer from Modern Methods. And I, that's, that's news to me, man. I never know. I never known you were black. Oh, well. Learn something every day. And you might learn something today, too. Not about this beer, because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Ah, today we have Modern Methods Brewing Giuseppe's Scooter, Italian Pilsner. Really? I never known that. Artwork by Laura Garvin of Pittsburgh, PA. And you can be IG at Snailberry Art or snailberryart.com. And how many alcohol content is this? 5.3. Right on. Did you know that the presidential limo? At it, the, the, the only window that rolls down is the is the drivers, so we can pay tolls, and it doesn't have keyholes, and only Secret Service knows how to open them up. There, you might learn that. Ah, uh, all right, what's going on here? Ooh, it's a little carbonated here. Look at that. I gotta go slow, slow with this one. Yeah, that's that's very carbonated, man. Look at that. Wow. Get that sucker. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Go slow. Slow going. Old Man River. This is probably going to taste like a um, beer and already or Peroni. I don't know. Actually made right down the street from me. Pour the rest in it later. Yes, this place is probably actually about two miles from here. From here. All right. Kind of clear. Got a slight haze to it. Up here in the, the other part, not perfectly clear. It smells hoppy. It does. I'm not lying. It smells hoppy. Anyways, the most remote ATM is by Wells Fargo in Antarctica. That's you going down there. I don't like the cold. I, I'd rather be hot than cold. Yeah, okay. It Tastes like a regular Pilsner, but has a little bit of hops in there. That's pretty good. Nothing like the last beer I had from them was the um, Raspberry Sour or something. I'm sorry, Adam Keck, the owner of Modern Methods. To me, it's undrinkable. I bought a four pack for $16.99. I dumped whatever I had in my glass and I took the, the other three to work, give the Brandon like sour beers. So I told him, man, you can have that sucker. You can have all three if you want. There you go. I like this. This is pretty good. I like a little bit of a bite. Now, I don't know what the IBUs are on it. It would be right here with the, the alcohol content. I'm going to say, and I'll look it up and I'll put it in a video. 20, probably 30. Let's see a 30, 35, so 30, 35. All right. That's a cute, that's a cute little bear hop falling out of there. That's not bad. Hershey's chocolate syrup, Dum Dums, and Oreos can all be eaten by vegans. Well, if you're a vegan, stay over there. I don't. No, I'm sorry. Now the reason people are vegetarians or vegans, or they're all vegetarians, is because they don't believe in killing an animal for food or something because that's torture or they, they feel pain. I was like, well, plants can feel pain too. They, they, they have feelings. So vegans, what are you gonna do? You know, you gotta stop eating plants, which 
everything anybody eats from beer to milk to, to, to anything, anything comes from plants. Man, think of that. Let that sink in, the old noggin. Everything you eat comes from plants. You mean you eat turkey? Nope, they have to eat, they eat the seed, the food, that comes from plants. Cow milk, eat beef, it comes from plants. Everything comes from plants. That's pretty cool. That's, that's deep thinking there. I don't know. What would I give this one? Uh, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. I will tell you, I will give it a B minus. A B minus. It's good. So, that being said, man, do you ever get, if you get a bruise or a cut on the end of your finger, if your fingers split because it's cold and they split, or you get a cut on the tip of your finger, you're gonna hit everything with that. You're gonna, you're gonna be banging that thing off of everything. You'll, you never know how many times you hit something until you, you, you get cut or bruised or something. You hit it all the damn time. It's insane. Anyways, for the last one, the phrase, liar, liar, pants on fire, there's a second verse. The other person says, I don't care, I don't care, I will buy another pair, or I can buy another pair. There you go, cheers.